Bank holiday, Monday. Is it? Yeah, 3rd of May. So, start on the vlog. I showed in the last video that I've got a cupboard full of stuff behind all that jewellery. And uh, I want to prop you up on the table. In fact, I'll show you, show you what's in it. Here we are. I've got all sorts of stuff in the bottom of there that are from uh, cake business. Uh, there was food grade um, wrap that went round cakes and stuff. I've got a uh, cake cutter. Uh, I've got things in there that were for display when I used to do the um, shows, like wedding cake shows. Anyway, we've got loads of toys and stuff stuck in the bottom of here. Um, I can't even remember what's in here. I can't remember if it's, it's things I've shoved away waiting for parts or or what. But I've decided now they're either going to go to charge shop or they're going to get listed as they are. So, yeah, I'll prop you up on the table and we'll see what's in here. Stands, vintage chic, glass topped cake stand. Uh, what's this one? Uh, two T 
here. Okay, it's done. That's a glass. Ooh, that's a glass one. Um, I can't remember what that is. Up there. So it says fragile on it. Uh, no, I can't get through it. I need a stool. Uh, empty. Empty. They're just staying where they are at the minute. It's definitely all cake stuff. I've got this light brocade paper I used to have as a background. So you have to, you used to have to go early, uh, put that up at the back, and then I'd got a load of tassels and stuff that I used to hang. And somebody had made me a stand to put all cakes on. The only thing I'm leaving in here for now is that, because I know uh, its motor wasn't working, but I have got a motor that needs mending, so... I'll leave that in there, but show you what we've got. Right. <laughs> um, we've got two Fifi teapots and play set for me to sort out. Uh, a little bit of Connex uh, extras. May as well sell that as a lot. Uh, this I'll have to open when I've got two hands. This is... Uh, oh, right. While I'm showing you this, I've just realised. See these long fingernails? Yeah, I did them. And I haven't done them yet. <laughs> I'm a proper nail tech now, you know, because they all have odd hands when they're doing videos. Uh, right, I'll open that. That's quite interesting. Somebody might help me with that. Uh, stickle bricks. I was keeping the box for if I got more to fill it up. So some of this might go back in cupboards, some might go. I don't even know if I've got the sales for them, but I have found a bag full of stuff. Here. I think it might be priority. Yeah. They're pirate bits. Ah, uh, castle. Another pirate ship. Um, little people pirate ship uh, jigsaw. That's from Paw Patrol, so I should have got some other Paw Patrol. Oh, this, but I don't know if it fits onto it. Um, this is ELC. Uh, station and track but I don't know if there's enough track or something missing there's got to be something otherwise I would have sold it as a set at the time uh, but that train works so yeah what's this oh, I think that's something to do with a little bit now I've got these which I picked up from a charity shop at some point and uh, as you can see InnoTab VTech and it'll have been a oh that's a bit technical I don't know how it works thing uh, V smile cyber pocket no idea no idea on these there's a box smile motion uh, and that's in the tab box don't know what that is and then this opens a whole new ball game as well Ah, back away. <laughs> um, and uh, what's that? Tra family trainer, we Treasure Island. No idea. I'll need two hands to get that lot out. Um, what's this? That's the Wii console. Loads of games. And these. I thought these were uh, Activision. What does it say? I thought these were, uh, oh, I forgot what you call them. <sighs> Come on, somebody. Yeah, uh, no, it's gone. It's gone out of my head. Hmm. I sold a load as well. Oh, I don't know, but there's a load of them. Uh, but that's just made me think that 
Oh. Go in here. a box there. Now I know Stephen took a set but I don't know what else is in there. There could be boards or anything. Uh, in fact is there any still down here? A uh, the wee fit board there look. So yeah it's going to be a fun couple of days this. Right what I'll do is I'll uh, come back and show you um I'll show you when I make some sets up, but I'll just just put me down a minute so I can open that. Now it's a house, and it's purple at one side and orange at the other. It's got a carry handle on it, and. Open it. Go on. That's it. Right. I can open it. When you open it up, it drops down, and that's a garden. And then the rest of the house there. But the figures, I've never managed to find out what they are. The figures are beautiful. It's all toddlers and babies. Look. Toddlers and babies, so it's like a little playground with a slide. There's a little girl, little girl toddler there. She's got, there's a pattern on it. I spent hours at the time looking this up. Uh, it looks like little lilies or something on, little high chair look. Another little baby. Uh, and then these ones, they've got little romper suits on. He's got a hat on, there's no markings on them whatsoever. Uh, it looks definitely vintage. I mean, look at this little bonnet and a slide. So it's, it is old, but I don't know what from. Um, there's a swing. There's a swing, a seesaw, all sorts of things. Uh, there's even a horse and carriage in here. Though I don't know whether that's got anything to do with it. It's the right colour plastic though. A little horse and carriage look. So, no idea. Nothing written on it at all. But it's the right colours. So if anybody's got any clues, please let me know. The little house inside is all um, got the stickers in them, so it makes different rooms. Oh, little seesaw. It's a beautiful little thing, but I really don't know how to describe it other than Vintage baby toddlers play house. There's nothing on the outside of it at all. No brand names or anything. Yeah, so that's that. Anyway, I'll come back when I've let you know what I'm actually doing with this lot. Right, so it is uh, Thursday. I've been busy. I've took bagfuls of stuff in the loft and uh, I've put them all away. So I'll take you up in a bit and show you that my shelves are filling up nicely. But I've got 10 things that I've been listing that I have got bids on. So starting from tonight, it shouldn't be too bad on sales. But obviously at the minute, because I've been listing on auction, uh, it's been a bit, a bit of a slow week in sales, really. So I'm going to do this one. This is... Um, the Fisher Price 1994 or 6 uh, pirate ship, and then these aren't actually part of it, these are red box pirates. If you see these, you can't see their eyes in that, uh, they're red box pirates. 
Uh, these are the ones that come with the fish price. I think there's a glow in the dark masked one there. So that's that, and we've got the rafts. I found the barrels, and you uh, fire them off there. That's it. Uh, there's a cannon in it, but it doesn't work. So I want to put, uh, you'll be pleased for your furniture <laughs> that the cannon doesn't work. So that's that anyway, it's just a little plaything for somebody. Uh, I've also pulled out what I'm going to photograph after that. So um, these were all in my spares box, but I went through my spares box to see if I'd got any more pirates. And I found this, I was saving this for if I got one of the big orange ones. Um, but I've decided I'm not doing that now. I'm I'm just going to get them on. So there's him and I found a little friend for him. Uh, this is a VTech uh, animated something, which I've got to look up. Uh, we've got Tiny Clanger. Who's well, not that tiny, but she's called Tiny. And she talks. Well, Clanger talk. Uh, and you don't see many of them, they're normally soft toys, so I'll put that on auction. This is Blue Nose Bear car. They actually fit Sylvanian. So if you've got anybody that's got Sylvanian and you want a little little car, it'll be a lot cheaper. I'm just going to put that on auction for a few quid. Uh, there's a Polly Pocket house, which I found in the spares. And then on the side, I don't know if you can see through the window... On the side over here near the Lego, I'd found a couple of Polly Pockets and I'd just chucked them on there. So I thought, oh, I know what will go with that. That's that. A pair of boots my sister gave me. Uh, that are brand new. She bought them and didn't... She didn't like them for her. And I'll show you in the cupboard. Because uh, this was what I was clearing and sorting through. So I did leave that one in there. And then the only thing I put back in was all this wee stuff. So, I'm going to do that after. Yes. So, I'll bring the other box full that's in the other room. And that's what I'm going to do after that. So, that's today's, apart from a nice long bubble bath. And then, I've got to get into this corner here, which is odds and sods of, oh, you name it. So, I've emptied that one as well. Yeah, I've got clothes, mirrors, pictures, Playmobil spares, kids bags you name it but uh, it's gonna be bin charity shop or sell done it oh and i finished my other and and they're too long and i can't cope and i've got to take them down but pretty um, pretty aren't they yeah so if you want to see them there's a video coming up self-promotion and all that <laughs> right I'll leave you with pirate ship Hello, so it's about nine o'clock at night. I've done these. They're ready to go upstairs. I realised that it was glowing the dark cannon uh, as well as a figure in that. Uh, what did they call it? Ghost Raiders. Anyway, uh, I've also done these. So they're all packaged up, ready with the stickers on. They go, can go in the loft. And then there's a few that I did yesterday. So I can chuck all those in there in the back as well but i'm just going to settle down and have a look and see if some auctions that are finishing uh, end up going up um i've just sold two or three today on auction and i've also got these um going so i've logged in very different accounts so i can see if it goes up how long have i got oh 12 minutes 11 minutes and counting so i'll come back to that in a little bit Okay, so we're at 7 minutes and a half, 7.31. So, you'll see that clock jump because if nothing else happens, I'll go right to the end. Uh, otherwise, I'll jump to where any new bids come in. But uh, I'll keep filming it. It's been quite an exciting day for me, actually, having some auctions finishing. So, well, less than five minutes, you'd expect anything to happen at the sort of whole minutes marked. 
people trying to get in with these sniping things like five minutes, four, three, two, one. Um, it was at about 25 earlier today, so these other bids have come in in the last hour. Um, so that might be where it's going to stay. I wish I'd have filmed one that I've just had. It was a, a job lot of uh, broken sort of crafting beads, jewellery mix. Uh, three kilos, I had it on at 15 and it went up to 27 at the last minute. So this one I'm filming is probably going to be a boring one, but I have got another one coming after this, which is a PS2 with lots of games with it. So we'll have a look at that one as well. I'll refresh, but I don't think I need to. I think because I can see that timer going down. You can't see this if you if you log into it through your own account. You have to keep refreshing, but I've gone in on a different one to watch it. Did you see that clock jump? We've gone under the two minutes now. Okay, so we're under a one minute, so I've skipped to that now for you. So we'll just leave it running for this end bit and see. See if anybody comes in at, in at the end. But I've got a feeling they're not going to do because they were bidding up to about an hour ago. <clears throat> oh, 41. We've had a two pound jump. Well, a step, a two pound step rather than a jump. <laughs> Drum roll. Forty five. That's it, forty five. Excellent. So that's that. Brilliant. So I'll go back and have another look at the um, the other one that's coming up and see what time that is. Uh, I'll go to my my shop again. Right, ending soonest next is this one, uh, which is fifty six pound. Five bids on this one and eight minutes left. So this is the PS2 with all those games, this, uh, everything from age three to 18. And uh, so kids, adult, horror, racing, you name it, quite a good mix. And um, So I'll just keep jumping this time forward for you to watch uh, and I'll sit and uh, film it all so I can edit the, the bits out with no movement. So we're under seven minutes and nothing, nothing as yet so it's probably going to happen if anything after the five minute mark. I'm sat here holding this uh, mobile phone to film it, I could have done screen capture. Right, so we've gone under the four, so nobody put anything in at the four minute mark. So one minute 56. No action yet. God, this is thrilling stuff, this. <laughs> oh dear. I think the most thrilling auction I've ever had was when I was away with some friends in their caravan and it was about half past ten at night and I'd got a job lot of dinosaurs and, um, oh, it's just jumped up to 62. Yeah, I had a job lot of dinosaurs and they were going, like I said, about half ten, eleven at night and uh, it was just going crackers and it ended up going, I started at about £20, it went for about 62. <laughs> It was lovely to be sat with friends and these uh, notifications kept coming in. So, 62 with one minute left. So, 
So I'll leave this uh, last one minute on and see if anything happens in the dying seconds. If anybody's sat physically watching it, they might wait till like 10 seconds off or something like that. Or not. There might not be anybody there. Is there anybody there? <laughs> Come on, another couple of steps would be nice. No, that's it. Oh, 72 in the last second. <laughs> nice one. Oh, that was nice. £10 extra in the last second. So lovely. That one's done. And uh, that's it. I'll just turn you around. So, I hope that made a bit of a change. <laughs> um, I think what I might do, because I've just had a look at editing and it's uh, it's getting on there now, how long this video is. So, I'm going to have a good tidy up in here. I said I was going to do the wee, but tomorrow I think I might need to go to um, jewellery. I've picked out... Um, <gasps> picked out one of my hangers that's got all the sort of chunky stuff on so I might do that tomorrow so I can just sit here and have a bit a bit less a bit less pulling and pushing stuff about tomorrow so I'll get this edited and uploaded for you thank you ever so much for watching and I love you loads take care bye <music>